remembers like the 90s where if someone got on the phone, the internet went down. <laughs> or remember having to pay per minutes? Well, that's web one, right? It was all, it was all billboards. It was all like advertisements. It was all information um, being dropped from the companies and from businesses. Now, web two is really about social media. It's about sharing and everybody sharing information um, and it's centralized, right? Facebook owns all the information, owns a ton of information. Google owns a ton of, ton of all of that information is centralized. Uh, in fact, if you weren't aware, like 70% of websites are built through three companies' servers. So three companies own 70% of the internet. It's very centralized. You get into Web3, and everything becomes decentralized. And I think the one thing that's gonna blow some heads in here, maybe from, out, from my understanding at least, is that the consumers own the information. The consumers have the right to sell it to you versus you pay them for it. It's a little bit of a different strategy. It's very bottom up. We're allowed to call it C to B instead of B to C. And that C can either be consumer, customer, or community, right? It's the community that's making the decisions to go through for Web3.